As food prices continue to rise, you may be searching for ways to save money while still feeding the whole family. Our next guest is a full-time working stepmom who took to TikTok to share her cash-crunching recipes while keeping it delicious. Rebecca Chobot joins us to share one of her Dollar Tree dinner meals. Thanks for being here. I love Dollar Tree for decorating. Thank you for having me. It, you may not know this, but a lot of Dollar Trees have refrigerators and freezers and sell a wide variety of food options as well. It's great. Okay, so tell us a little bit about you. How many mouths do you feed, and when did you make the switch from grocery tr store to Dollar Tree? So most of the year, I feed just myself and my boyfriend. However, we do have his two kids here a couple of months out of every year. And I started shopping at the Dollar Tree about a year or so ago as just a way to supplement my regular grocery trip and to explore some inexpensive options for people. I mostly started out making YouTube videos and recently made the switch to TikTok. Okay, congratulations. You've racked up 200,000 followers, 2 million likes. Uh, you've only been on the platform, I heard, like two months. I need lessons from you. Anyway, um, let's get to, uh, did you have a culinary background or did the recipe ideas just come easy to you? No, no culinary background. The only thing that I have is the meals that I've been preparing for my family and just sharing those with people and coming up with creative ideas based on the inventory that the Dollar Tree has that given week. Okay, so you're going to demo one of your hottest meals in just a second, but first you're going to show us two of your favorite snacks. Go for it. Sure, of course. First, we have these peanut butter oatmeal bars. These take just three ingredients and cost $3.75 to make. They're a perfect make-ahead snack, and I will be posting a video on this on my channel in the next couple of days or so. Okay, can I tell you, I'm big on healthy stuff. Peanut butter, honey, oats, those are great ingredients. That, that's so cool. I love that, and it's, it's inexpensive. What's your next one? So I have this tray of deli pinwheels here. This costs about $5 to make. It's a great after school snack or a lunch option if you don't have a microwave at your job. So I'll be also be posting a video on this in the next couple of days on my channel as well. Okay, uh, now you're actually gonna demo a meal. Is that right? Yeah. Yes. Okay, go for it. I'm, I'm curious to see this. So the meal we're gonna be demoing today is this beautiful chicken a la king skillet. It costs $6.25 to make and it will feed four people. You'll never know it's homemade. A lot of the ingredients you may already have, and it's a great way to use up leftovers. So I use two cans of chicken a la king. I use a can of chicken, a can of mixed vegetables, and a package of buttermilk biscuit mix. And it is quite simple. All you need is a skillet or some sort of a glass baking dish. I mix together all four of my canned ingredients here. Of course, I drained the vegetables and I preheated these on my stove top to a simmer. And you're just gonna simply pour that right into your baking dish. Pre-prepare your buttermilk biscuit mix. It's an add water mix, so no extra ingredients needed there. And you're just gonna scoop your biscuit mix right on top of your soup base. And then I bake this in the oven at 400 degrees for 15 minutes, and it is ready to go. That looks yummy. Okay, I gotta ask you two, two questions. What's it feel like to be famous all of a sudden and where can people find you? I don't feel famous all of a sudden, but it, <laughs> it is different. I didn't expect my third video on TikTok ever to go viral. So if anyone wants to check me out, I am at Dollar Tree Dinners on TikTok. <laughs> that is so funny. What's your family think? Uh, my boyfriend is so supportive of this. I mean, I've been doing it for a year now, and it just now kind of came into fruition, and he has been over the moon supportive of me in this. Oh, that is so sweet. Thank you so much for joining us this morning. Really appreciate your time. Have a wonderful day.